the rooms in the hotel are arranged in ascending order starting from 1 okay so they are in ascending order starting from 1 so it can be 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 10 like that no number is omitted so basically they are in order then kangaroo counted the digits of the room and found digit 2 14 times and digit 5 3 times okay what is the largest number of rooms there can be in the total okay first of all we got to know that no number is omitted right and oh, the rooms are starting from number 1 so it will be 1 2 3 4 and so on we don't know the count the easiest way of doing is is start from the least number which they have provided that is 5 occurs 3 times right so if we are starting from 1 we are starting from 1 correct we will get 5 and then we will get 15 and then we will get 25 right that's how we got exactly 3 fives because they have mentioned right kangaroo counted the digits and the digit 5 three times digit 5 occur three times exactly and they are asking us the largest number of rooms so we cannot go to 35 because if we will go to 35 then five digit will occur four times correct but can we say that there are 34 rooms right we cannot go to 35 because if we will go to 35 there will be four fives which will occur but we can say that there are 34 rooms that's how we satisfied the condition that there are three five correct so the correct answer is option number c but you can check if you are having time in your exam you can check how we can check two is uh, basically 14 times correct kangaroo counted the digits in the room and found number two 14 times so we can see that two right then we can have 12 then we can have 20 21 22 23 24 25 26 27 28 29 and then what we can have 32 correct so what i did i wrote the numbers the room numbers all from 1 to 34 which have 2 in it which have digit 2 in it now let's count whether we are having 14 or not 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 9 10 11 12 13 14 we are correct okay so what we can do we can start from the least count which they have provided us the easiest thing which they have provided us okay i hope it makes sense so here we are done with our three marker problems that came into math kangaroo 2024 exam so if you find any difficulties in any of the past year problems you can feel free to reach out and you can let us know that question number or in whatever question you are facing difficulties we will be happy to assist you and we are going to create the tutorial for the same i will see you soon with four marker problems and till then keep learning stay safe thank you so much